A Huntington woman is raising awareness about a medical condition that affects animals. SARDS stands for Sudden Acquired Retinal Degeneration Syndrome. It causes dogs and cats to go blind very quickly. And it's a devastating diagnosis, as you can imagine. But Shelly McCutcheon is sharing her dog's story to give hope to others. This way. Come on. This way. Turn. Good boy. This is how Shelly McCutcheon helps her dog Chumley get around. If I had to have my back deck ripped out and made flat because it was layered. He's learned how to map everything out. His vest lets people know what Shelly was devastated to learn. Chumley is blind. We were playing ball and... How long ago was that then? Two years ago, the 23rd of this month is when he was diagnosed, yes. Had to run him to a specialist in Indy. The otherwise healthy golden retriever had SARDS, a relatively rare condition that causes dogs and cats to go blind quickly. I knew something was wrong. Um, it was a huge adjustment. Chumley took it hard. Everything the Indianapolis specialist told Shelley to expect, Chumley went through. Depression, weight gain. It took a year, but things finally began to turn around. I take him to Huntington University and he runs on his own now off leash, following the command of my voice, and he goes full force. So. Chumley is now a therapy dog with Three Rivers visiting dogs. And he's the first uh, blind dog that Three Rivers has had. Shelly has this message for anyone who has an animal with a diagnosis. Oh Don't give up on him. Yeah. I had several people approach me and ask if I was going to have him put down. There's no reason to give up on him. I mean, other than losing his eyesight, he's happy, he's healthy. That's a good boy, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's one of the games that they play. It's called Bear, Love and it. they just kind of rough house with each other, and mm -hmm. he loves it. So she's found ways um, to get Chumley to just feel like a normal dog, sure. to be a normal dog, and it's gone a long way. So it was really hard. It really was devastating. But she says for folks who get that diagnosis for their animal, you can get through it, yeah. and the dog will be okay. Just as there's hope for humans who mm -hmm. go through something like that, there's hope for animals. Yeah, my parents have a blind dog. They didn't I know he was basically almost completely blind when they adopted mm -hmm. him, but he was, and he has a great life. Yeah, it didn't matter to them one day. Yeah. I know. No, We've talked about this several times, and yeah. it's just cool. There's some wonderful hearts out there, like mm -hmm. your parents and like Stephanie's, and these animals deserve every opportunity. Absolutely. Definitely. Yeah. Another great story we're talking about.